Well, welcome to the Yes Lady with Charla A, your encouragement solutions for outrageous business. And I am so incredibly honored and thrilled and really humbled to have Dr. Carla Russo with me today. Yes, I'm delighted to be here. Thank you for having me. It's time to say yes to your future. Each week, Charla A interviews business owners that are breaking the mold. Tune in each Thursday to discover how you can too. Here's your host, the Yes Lady herself, Charla A. So I'm so honored to have you here because you have you're like one of my heroes. I want you know you are just so out there with all that your all your education, all your memes, all your following, and you're always so kind and beautiful and uplifting and. I'm really grateful to reacquaint with you, and I want you, what we're talking here to the business owners of, of our community, you have so much to offer. And so it's our time now to kind of reconnect and, and share. I want to know what you're doing in a real way, and I also know that you uh, want to share that, and you want the community to help heal, because since I've known you, you've gotten your doctorate, and, yes. and you're in integrative medicine or integrative healing, right? Yes. So let's hear about that. What are you seeing out there and how are you helping? Well, first of all, it's truly my great pleasure and honor to be here with you today. It's always a pleasure to see you. You have such a beautiful servant's heart. And so when you asked for me to come do this, I, without hesitation, it was yes, though I wasn't really sure what this was going to look like. Um, I have done a lot since we last met up. I actually uh, achieved two doctorates. Oh, wow. So my husband jokes it's Dr. Carla squared. <laughs> um, and so my focus is integrative and functional wellness. I, uh, I don't practice. What I do is I teach. And so I primarily work with physicians and chiropractors and put tremendous emphasis on holistic and naturopathic measures for improving one's health. Because the truth of the matter is, is that if we took it back to Hippocrates, let thy food be thy medicine and thy medicine be thy food, there could be a lot learned by big pharma today and all the prescriptions being written. So for me, it's more a case of I like to educate. And so I do that uh, at every turn possible, mostly on a quarterly basis. Outside of that, Charlotte, not much has changed. I focus a lot on philanthropy and just sort of paying forward the immeasurable blessings that God has bestowed upon me. And I'm just so grateful to even be alive and be in a position where I can, that that's where I put all of my energy these days. And so I'm currently working on some pretty cool stuff that I'd love to share that's for the community that I think is going to really revolutionize a lot of lives in a lot of ways, dealing with subjects from addiction, recovery, weight loss, something I know a lot about, as you know, um, and more. And so I'm all about personal growth and development and truly living your best life and really being very mindful and very present to every moment and making the most of it. Well, I, it's fun to watch you on your social media and we'll just, it's your Facebook pages and um, Zen perspective. Zen perspective. Uh -huh. Yeah. And your well, your website. Dr. Carla, yeah. yeah. So you've got Dr. Carla mm -hmm. is is a brand. It's out there, and you're you're you know you're just truly one of the the best examples of philanthropy and giving back and making a difference everywhere you go. Well, thank you. But you know, I have to tell you that it's but for the grace of God that I'm even here. And, and that's that's part of the story. I know that your story and everybody has one. Some are, you know, just sure. really, really impactful and yours is. So do you want to share a little bit about your background? Sure. You know, the Reader's Digest version of it is as a child, I had been molested at age eight. And so that led to my becoming morbidly obese very rapidly all through my adolescence and teenage years. Uh, that culminated in more trauma. My first 10 weeks of high school, I was brutally beaten and raped. Oof. And uh, surviving that, though not quite sure really how I did at that young age of only 15, I opted out of high school at that point and went straight to college, which <laughs> now I'm damaged and I'm in an environment with uh, you know college kids doing what they do. And I'm just trying to survive. And it kind of all came to a head. Did very well in school, but it came to a head no sooner did I graduate that my mother died in front of me from congestive heart failure. <sighs> and as she was in full code, her physician said to me, this is you in five years, get it together. And he walked out. Now I was 330 pounds at the time. And so I knew, I had all the textbook knowledge. I just hadn't been able to apply it. 
And so at that point, I walked away from my nursing career and went back to school and put my focus into clinical nutrition and created a weight loss program that had me lose all of the weight in under nine months, what the media back then said, in less time than it takes to have a baby, I lost a whole person. And I've maintained it ever since 28 years later, eating real food, living real life, naturally, not living at the gym, because I'm not a fan of sweating, although I'm a big fan of yoga and stretching. <laughs> and so I went on to, as you know, create a program that went national and international and had phenomenal success. And I ended up working with every A-list celebrity that most people would know and recognize and just had a phenomenal career and was able to retire from that back in 2011. And it was then that I thought, there's more for me to do. God's far from done with me. And so I went back to school and worked on my doctorates. And with no intention of practicing or doing a business, but rather how could I then use all of that experience and all of those credentials to really impact and serve people and just love people? Because I firmly believe that love is the answer. If we could let our pride and ego get out of the way, we wouldn't have all the hate trids that exist and all the wars and all the problems. And so I thought, well, how do I use this to do some good? And that kind of has led me to present day. I do have various businesses in the wellness space of you know various things, but my passion right now is the programs that I'm rolling out here come this Labor Day in just a couple of weeks to help the community with all the things I've talked about and more. That's, so. that's really great because this should, uh, Let's see, this show will actually air probably in September, so uh, it'll be right around that time. It'll great. be great timing for us to get this word out about some of these programs that you're talking yeah. about. And I know that you know your, your experience, everyone has stories, everyone has hurts. We're nearly all, all of us are five-year-olds, eight-year-olds that are just, you know, everything we do from that moment of hurt is in a protective mode. Everything, I, I'll never be hurt like that again. And so we build up those walls and boundaries, sometimes it's, sometimes it's weight, sometimes it's attitude, sometimes it's you know, words or whatever. And so we're always looking for uh, ways to protect ourselves from never, be, I'll never be hurt like that again. Mm -hmm. And that little, tiny little child is, is inside of us right. screaming that I need love and just love me no matter what. And the harder I am to love, the more I need it. Well, and that's where that's my passion. And so that we're clear, you know, I'm, I'm not a, a medical doctor. I don't practice medicine. My focus is nutrition, health science, integrative wellness. Um, and my, my passion is behavioral science. And so as a behaviorist, I work with the personality behind what you see, meaning when I see someone overweight, I don't see a fat person, I see a lot of drama and trauma. When I see someone with any kind of an addiction, alcohol, exactly. drugs, sex, television, shopping, whatever the case is, there's much more to it. So for me as a behaviorist, it's about peeling away those layers of the onion, which at first are challenging, they sting, they burn, but you get to the sweet center and you really get to the core of that. And so you can reframe whatever has happened you don't have to be held hostage or bound by any drama trauma. Lord knows I certainly have had more than my fair share inarguably, but it never held me back. And I developed those tools and then was able to put the academia with it to figure out systems that really help free up people in an unconventional way. And I think that's where my passion is fueled that you can take wonderful programs as we might know them, but there's room for improvement. And I feel that by marrying the clinical aspects, the spiritual aspects, and addressing all areas of life so that even if your focus is an addiction or it's weight or it's your finances, in order to have balance, you have to have mental, physical, spiritual, emotional, intellectual. So all of it has to be working. Otherwise, if there's a, a, a void in one of those, you're going to fill it with something that's likely not the best choice for you. So everything I do today as it relates to programs is about doing that, culminating true balance and true wellness that's functional in every aspect. So it's, it's been. And, that, and it's so incredibly needed. Every yeah. single one of us has something that, yeah. you know, that we need to let go. Yeah. And we don't, so many of us don't even know it. Sometimes we plan it back here and, it, and our past is directing our future mm -hmm. and we don't even know it. Mm -hmm. And if we can take that past out of our future, 
right. then we have unlimited possibilities. Absolutely, and it's really, it's not so much removing the past because you need to know where you've been in order to know where you're going, but it's reframing it, and it's not allowing the excuses because we're our biggest obstacle, mm, we're the biggest absolutely. barrier we have. And so I deal with you know, aspiring entrepreneurs, what have you, that they only seem to get so far and they don't realize that there's much more behind, that they're still lugging with them, that they've got it framed in such a way that it's not letting them maximize their true potential or it's holding them back and being the best version of themselves. So it's, it's a little deeper than that. So I think it really starts at behavior fundamentally and reframing what's happened because in the end of the day, and I said this to you recently, it doesn't matter where you've been, it doesn't even matter where you are right now. The question is, is where do you want to go? And where you are right now is all you have. Yeah. So right this second is all we have, and we have this second to take the next step from. Yeah. And, and that's, what else do we have, right? So exactly. it, it, we, we can't change yesterday, we can't change last year, last generation, we can't change last second, we can only change the next second by taking the next step. Yeah. And so that's exactly what I feel like your, your, your expertise is, is helping us recognize the next step. And, and, and some of that. So we're gonna have to take a quick break here. And this, as it always goes so fast, I'm like, oh, you have so much wisdom to offer. Oh, thank you. So this is Charla Anderson, the Yes Lady, and we'll be right back after these messages. The American business economy is positioned as it has never been before. Professional videography is a core element for attracting a higher level of engagement with the people group you need for significant impact. Now is your time to shine. My name is Bill Brock, owner of White Rock Films, and I invite you to a powerful opportunity in the marketplace, an opportunity to draw excited people to your events, an opportunity to showcase your ideas on infrastructure, an opportunity to become known as the industry authority and enjoy the associated benefits of a strong, influential brand. Video highlights, video teaches. Video puts a resistant market at ease, and video stirs the hearts and imaginations of your allies and strategic client base. White Rock Films offers full audio, video production for businesses ready to embrace the future, handling your project with professionalism, experience, and polish unheard of in the industry. My name is Bill Brock, and White Rock Films wants your business. See us online at whiterockfilms.com. Experience the Zeal difference. It's my favorite beverage. I never thought nutrition could taste so good. I know it's why I feel the best I've ever felt. Wouldn't start my day without this beverage. Every once in a while, a product comes along that's so innovative, it has the ability to shake up how we feel about nutrition. You're about to be introduced to a one-of-a-kind nutritional powerhouse. It's scientifically formulated and backed by a landmark clinical trial. This wellness product has created a movement that has already generated over 300 million in sales. It continues to change lives, create a thirst in people to be healthier, and is inspiring generations in ways other beverages simply do not. It's called Zeal, and thousands of people worldwide, just like you, appreciate that it takes the guesswork out of nutrition and why it's loved by so many. If you don't experience the Zeal difference in 30 days, we'll refund your money. Join us in this movement and experience the Zeal difference. Okay, we're back here. The Yes Lady with Charla A. with Dr. Carla Russo, and we've been talking about your past a little bit and now your and your passion mm -hmm. and now we're going to talk a little bit more about your future which yes. is some incredibly exciting programs for our community here yes. in the dfw area yes. and and i'm so excited to know more about those because very needed and every one of us knows people that have addicts addicts in their family from either drugs alcohol or some of the other things you've Right, well, there's a plethora of programs that are going to be available to everyone. So it's, these are free programs, and they are wonderful programs, and they're going to meet different needs. And so if someone is struggling with addiction of any kind, be it alcohol, drugs, sex, shopping, whatever the addiction that's got a hold of you, we are running a beautiful, beautiful addiction recovery and support group program starting the first Monday after Labor Day, so starting on the 10th, I believe that is. Um, that's going to be running every week. And then there's going to be another program for those that are struggling with weight, whether it's a little bit or a lot, morbidly obese, doesn't matter, or you've had some health changes. We're going to be running a weight loss program on Wednesday nights. 
uh, super excited about Saturday mornings. We're going to be offering classes in chair, therapeutic, and rehabilitative stretching and movement, as well as mat work. And then that'll be followed by cardio and Zumba classes. So they can come at 8 a.m. for the restorative type of yoga class or a 9 o'clock cardio Zumba type class. And so there's just a lot of programs, and these programs are being run by qualified professionals, which is what's so important, and they are free to the community. There's That's no, amazing. There's, it's, it's such a joy of mine to be, to be so blessed to be pulling all of this together. I'm super excited. And so, you know, these are programs that, on the average, are very costly for people to attend, right? If you're trying to work with a licensed uh, addiction rehab specialist, you'd have to go pay that individual. Well, that's who I have running this program on a weekly basis. Wow. And the Wednesday night class is something that I will personally be teaching wellness and weight loss and all of that, um, something that I've done you know, very well in, in a corporate setting professionally in the past, but now being retired from that, I just want to give it away and pay it forward. And then certainly the fitness classes, being in a controlled environment, being therapeutic and rehabilitative. So if you are restricted, be it by weight or by injury or what have you, just gives you some options and some things to plug into in a really great setting. And where exactly? Yeah. Because we're talking, um, it's in the Dallas area. Yes, it right. is. So if you're familiar with Mockingbird Station, which is off of Mockingbird Lane and uh, 75 Central Expressway, it is in that vicinity. And the uh, name change and all of this to the venue is taking place today, but it will be today. known as Mockingbird wow. Community. And it's a wonderful facility. And so, you know, for more information, I, I certainly am happy to share all the details. They can just reach out to me. Okay, so you're, the website you really want someone to go to would be? Yes, absolutely. So you can message me directly from my website, zenperspective.com, and uh, I will absolutely respond to your email and give you all the details or call you personally and get you plugged into the right program. So how, how did this come about? I mean, that's a, that's a big deal what yeah. you're doing. It's a really big deal. And yeah. you've, you've been on the stage with, with people know who yeah. you've been, you know, they would know the names, yeah. very well known. And yeah. you, so you've, 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 and you've done so many amazing things and now it's your time to give back. Well, I've been giving back and I've well, been doing philanthropy back, but, for yeah. a long time. This is a very foreign stage for me. And this is where I, uh, you know, I don't impose my personal beliefs on anyone. I'm very Christian heart, very Zen mindset. And, uh, never did I think that any kind of ministry would be in my path. And so this has sort of become, it's not a religious thing, but it's, I call it my wellness ministry because I'm pulling together, I'm calling in favors and I'm calling in my friends and everyone that has something to, to give, a gift, a talent that I've been able to rally the troops on behalf of really just wanting to serve and wanting to help by literally collaboratively pulling together something in a ministry fashion that's just extraordinary. But the reason it's so extraordinary is, is because it's, uh, it doesn't matter what you believe, who you believe in, if you believe at all. These are programs that are fundamentally sound programs, whether it's for addiction support or the weight loss or the physical activity or the mindset mindfulness classes or all these things that we're offering. So it's a true collaborative effect and hence the uh, pastor of the church facility that we're using is uh, extraordinary and he has a beautiful heart and is lining up what's known as Mockingbird Collaborative. And so he's pulling in different organizations and it's all for the community. We're stepping outside the conventional, what you would expect to see and doing something really spectacular. And I'm just honored to be a part of it. I'm attracting right now so many of programs that have so many benefits mm -hmm besides money, right? So, that, I mean, that, that people are just really wanting to make a difference in the community. And for whatever reason, I'm a magnet to that, which is awesome, right? Yeah. I have, you know, I, I've, uh, and we've talked, we have a, um, I, with Susan, and we have a program that is uh, a membership program. And it's called One Race United. And I'll just say that because it, it has a, a component. It's going to have so many things, and it costs five dollars and ninety-five cents a month to be the membership and get the discounts and then the benefits and have a marketplace on there, a visa with little or no fees. That how many people that are unbanked that don't even have a, mm -hmm. a card? So this a payment solution mm -hmm. 
for a lot of people in, in many ways too. So that's just one of the components that I, you know, and I want to share more about that with you because I believe it will help so many of your clients because it's so low cost and it's, it's pervasive in, in every area of our lifestyle. We'll be able to get save money and make money as well. Well, it's no surprise that you're attracting people that are wanting to serve and give back. I know that one of the things that, um, that, that is super exciting about this whole collaborative effect and the whole Mockingbird Station area and that part of Dallas being so centrally located in such a hot area because it's right by Highland Park, it's right north of downtown, uptown, it's just a booming, booming area. So we can really reach thousands and thousands of homes that live in that vicinity and people, but people really are going to be coming in from as far north as Frisco because these programs are so special and they're phenomenal programs and they're, there's no catch to it. It's just a true offering. No catch, offering. no there's strings, nothing, no agenda, nothing, just nothing, nothing. serving. We're serving. just, it's all being given away. That's where our heart's at. And we're uniting with some wonderful big organizations. Um, you know, Unite Dallas is a huge organization, not-for-profit, that aligns different not-for-profits together. So they're collaborating with us. Um, wow. I'm bringing in domestic violence programs through the state of Texas. So definitely y'all are gonna wanna check out and learn more about what's going on because it's beyond even what I've just shared here today. There's a lot available to everyone from children to seniors and everything in between at any stage of, of their life, mentally, physically, spiritually, emotionally, financially. We're gonna be bringing in all kinds of classes and workshops all free. Oh, I'm so yeah. excited. I am too. I mean, really. That, yeah. So I, I've noticed that the, the world, my, my world is shifting towards collaboration and not competition. Mm -hmm. There's seven and a half billion people in this world. We don't have to compete right. necessarily mm -hmm. for, for business even. We, you know, let's win, win, win. How can we serve and win? And we all win when we do that. And I'm, I'm so excited for that. Um, is there, do you mind if I ask about um, offenders? Do you have any programs for ex-offenders and uh, that? Yeah, actually, yes. Just yesterday we solidified, I solidified a, an opportunity where the Texas Criminal Justice Department has a program where they mandate certain programs and recovery for uh, domestic violence. They weren't severe enough to have served time, but they are ordered to participate in programs. We're actually going to be offering that um, at, oh, at Mockingbird wow. Center. And so that's a weekly program that'll be running available twice a week. The flip side of that on the victim side, I was just meeting with a very good friend of mine who's playing a huge role in this. Uh, Dee Romero is going to be heading up some of the physical fitness classes. And uh, she herself has had a lot of experience in working and helping women and through her own personal story that have been the victim and dealt with abusive men and so how to how to get out of that and how to really move on with your life and pick up the pieces and really get your life straight and in order and so yeah all kinds of really great things are coming so it's huge and you know we we know that we can change our words and change our life mm -hmm. and, and I call it a split second transformation we can truly make a difference and so but not everybody gets that and so you, what, what we're offering out here for the world, for the community, and it will be a, hopefully a prototype. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. A prototype for other communities. That's the idea. Uh, that is our intention because exactly. there are so many facilities all around the country that whether it's schools or churches that have unused space. And a lot of malls are closing these days, things yeah. like that. There's a lot of retail space mm -hmm. that is, mm -hmm. is totally vacant yeah. and could be repurposed. Absolutely. And to elaborate a little bit on what you just said, yes, words we can change and transform in a moment. And that sounds fabulous. And it's true. But the thing is, is it's much deeper than that. Exactly. You know, because if it was really that simple, then nobody would have issues and everybody would just poof and be great. That's where I, as an educator, as a professor, for me, I teach the baby steps. Because if I can teach you to have small successes, they will lead to bigger successes, right? And if I can reframe certain practices into healthier practices, and if I can teach you to kind of just move at a certain pace, before you know it, you're where you want to be. And it wasn't a click, but you're there and you stay there versus the relapse. Exactly. So, but, so the education piece is huge. Is huge. Mm -hmm. That's your expertise. Yeah. I am so incredibly grateful that you took the time to come and be with us today. Yeah. You're beautiful. You're stunning. You're fabulous. Yeah. And you, 
your heart exceeds all of that. Well, truly. Thank you. So I love you much. I oh thank gosh, you for thank coming. You. And the Yes Lady will be back next week. Hi, I'm the Yes Lady with Charla A. Powered by Zeal Wellness. Zeal is my nutrition beverage of choice. It is 14,000 milligrams of superfood nutrition in a powdered formula that you can just shake it and take it out the door, grab and go have energy, vitality, reduce your stress, some incredible health benefits. It's incredibly cost effective and it is going to change your life. I'd love for you to join me. Go to charla.zealforlife.com, charla.zealforlife.com. Join me in being healthy, focused, full of energy, tastes great. Zeal for life. That's all for the Yes Lady with Charla A today. The Yes Lady with Charla A is produced by the OBBM Network and available on demand at offbeatbusinessmedia.com. The Yes Lady also airs each Thursday at 12 and 8 p.m. on OBBM Radio, available on iTunes and offbeatbusinessmedia.com. Download the Offbeat Business app to get the Yes Lady TV and podcast on demand. To be a guest on the Yes Lady, call 817-808-7703.